This is a common goddess snake. <clears throat> Hold on, relax. Relax. This is the brown red phase. Just shed. It still has some shed on its head too. Still has some shed on its head. I don't know how aggressive it is. It doesn't seem too aggressive. Um, this is different from the checkered phase because, as you see, its colors are much darker. Um, it does have a nice iridescence around it, though. Very cool snake. This one's actually a lot more active than the other ones. I'm kind of like nervous holding it. I don't know if it's going to strike. <laughs> um, I'm waiting for it to calm down. But yeah, this is the much darker um, phase than the one we caught yesterday. Still rubbing the musk on me. Um, still not biting though, I'm surprised. Maybe it's just too little. Doesn't think I'm that much of a threat. I'm not sure. But um, before we captured it, it did puff up a bit. So, I don't want to mess with it too much. Um, yeah, Chris, press on it and make it focus on the scales. You can press on the screen where you want it to focus. Yeah, I know. It'll come in much yeah. clearer. Seems to be calming down now. I like that... Uh the yellow little like yeah, it's iridescent, it's really cool. Scales that they have. Just finished shedding and we got it. Really tame has a black tip on its tongue, it's just smelling the air right now. Um, now these guys will hunt amphibians, salamanders, toads. Um, they're also known to hunt snails of different kinds. Um, really cool snake. Um, yeah. I don't know what else I can say about them. This one's really dark brown. It's kind of like... I wouldn't even be able to know it's a goddess snake if I didn't see its face. Because it's so dark. And it does kind of have a checkered pattern under the dark darkness of it. But it's definitely the, a dark brown reddish face. Red kind of goes on the tail. I don't know if you can see it. It kind of fired up and darkened when we caught it. but Very cool. Alright, we'll go put this guy back.